The way they are actually done in process is completely different. My hair is actually dry. I mean, it's a little bit damp from just the, the spray I just put in it, but it's for the most part dry. With a jerry curl, it cannot get dry at all or it's gonna come out in balls. I had a Wave Nouveau and that crap took my hair out in balls. It, it, I wanted it to look like this and then getting it to look like this, dry, came out in balls, it was terrible. Plus, this is my second one and my first one was a lot shorter, so it actually does help your hair grow and retain length. Plus, if I want, I can still do braids, braid outs, any of that. Whereas before with my Wave Nouveau, that's ri that ripped my hair out. Anyways, I totally recommend this. It has given me so much freedom with my hair, which I wanted. I wanted to be able to like wake up and wear my own hair and I just could not figure it out. And this really helped me. For the millionth time, this is not a jerry curl. <laughs> Though the way they are done looks similar, the way they are actually done in process is completely different. My hair is actually dry. I mean, it's a little bit damp from just the, the spray I just put in it, but it's for the most part dry. With a jerry curl, it cannot get dry at all or it's gonna come out in balls. I had a Wave Nouveau and that crap took my hair out in balls. It, it, I wanted it to look like this and then getting it to look like this, dry, came out in balls, it was terrible. Plus, this is my second one, and my first one was a lot shorter, so it actually does help your hair grow and retain length. Plus, if I want, I can still do braids, braid outs, any of that, whereas before with my Wave Nouveau, that's ri that ripped my hair out. Anyways, I totally recommend this. It has given me so much freedom with my hair, which I wanted. I wanted to be able to like wake up and wear my own hair, and I just could not figure it out, and this really helped me. The Gina Curl. <laughs> wanted a pros and cons list of my hair so I'm gonna give it to you. Pro is I can get in the shower and get out and I know that my hair is gonna turn out exactly how I want it to every time. Wash days are now wash hour if that. I haven't washed my hair in a few days but I wake up and spray conditioner in it and then just go and it turns out great and I still get compliments all day. I sleep with my hair in a bonnet take it out and shake it and then usually it's good enough to go and if not I just spray a little conditioner in it and it's fine. <laughs> Another thing is this has the ease of a protective style. I went out of town yesterday and I didn't have to worry about braiding it, wigging it up. I just brought my conditioner and that was it. It was great. So this is a pro and a con, but your hair ends up growing really fast because you're just, you can get to your scalp so easily, moisturize it like daily. I'm treating my scalp, which means that new growth comes in very, very fast. And that's the part, that's the only thing that sucks is that new growth is just blending the textures. That's why I got a tighter curl. So hopefully it blends better as it grows out, so. This comment right here is amazing and perfectly explains why I got a Gina curl. First of all, I was natural for years and actually did try with my hair. Basically, my life consisted of washing it and braiding it up and putting it in protective styles or under a wig. Plus, my mother was the one braiding it and she's a perfectionist. She was great at braiding my hair, doing my hair, all of that. But she has carpal tunnel and watching her struggle through my hair was just, it was discouraging. Doing my own hair in general was discouraging. It took hours. I was definitely living for my hair. Plus I have eczema on my scalp and I lost all my hair as a child and I still have tender spots from that that never fully healed. So doing my hair was not just discouraging, it was very painful. And y'all 4C girls know, you gotta have arm strength. So I just started looking for ways to make this easier. And I was tired of being bullied into keeping my natural hair to make everybody else comfortable, but me. Fry it, dye it, curl it, lay it to the side, whatever, it's your hair. Changing your hair does not mean you hate yourself. Other races do it all the time. Plus I always wear wigs. Y'all never saw my natural hair. You are not attached. And not one of y'all was here every day trying to do it for me.